The following video covers proper fastening techniques for zip system sheathing. There are four simple ways to minimize the impact of excessive air pressure in creating overdriven fasteners. One is to install an adapter on the nail gun. A second method is to use a gun with a built-in adapter. A third method is using an inline air pressure regulator that attaches to the hose which regulates the pressure entering the nail gun. The last method is to use the pressure regulator on the compressor to lower the air pressure at the source. Any of these remedies will decrease the likelihood of overdriven fasteners. A properly installed fastener is one in which the outside face of the fastener is flush to the zip system sheathing surface. Other situations encountered during installation include fasteners that only partially hit the stud or end up installed touching the side of the stud. These are typically referred to as shiners. Fasteners that miss the stud may shoot completely through the zip system sheathing, creating a hole. These are typically referred to as blow-throughs. These conditions require repair to maintain the structural integrity of the zip system weather resistive barrier. A shiner can be repaired by backing out the nail, then removing it from the front of the sheathing, then using zip system flashing tape to seal the hole. Roll the tape. A blow through is typically discovered by noticing light shining through the hole and can be repaired from inside the building. Because of the irregular hole created by the blow through, zip system liquid flash is preferred over zip system flashing tape for this repair. Find more technical tips and product information by visiting youtube.com forward slash zip system sheathing.